Hey guys, what's up? Uh, I know it's been a really long time. Uh, super sorry about that. Uh, long story short, uh, I tried recording again for Sonic Generations for episode 3, and then stuff happened. And my computer was like, hey, you can't do that. And I was like, alright, I guess. So, <laughs> um, so I wanted to do something a little bit different today. Um, I've done maybe one other video like this, I think, uh, with the Wii U. Uh, it's a kind of unboxing video. It's already out of the plastic wrap. Don't tell anyone that. But, um, so, I have it right here on my desk. You can't see it, and you will see it in about two seconds. Boom. Don't mind the keyboard. This is a little bit different for me. I'm trying to coordinate. This is a uh, Kingdom Hearts uh, 1.5 HD Remix. That's the front. And here's the back business that's going on. Sora Mickey Organizations. Organizations. What am I saying? Organization 13. Um, and then it comes, believe it or not, so this is what you get, the original, like, the plain, like, the box, the outside. And it's about the standard size of a DVD case. And, of course, I have nothing right next to me for comparison. This is going so well. Um, so, uh, actually, I thought it was going to open from the top. It's actually, the book slides out right from the side. So there's the case. Here's the book. There's the front. The, uh picture of Sora that everyone knows. Um, and then there's this picture on the back, and I'm not quite sure what that is. I feel like that's maybe the original design for Sora, with a Lion King tail and, like, highlights. I'm not sure. Um, I haven't read through the book. I haven't done anything. I just kind of took the plastic off already, so you don't have to hear me do that. Um, so you get this. And then, I haven't even opened it, I haven't gone through it. Um, I think that's one of the pictures from the comic. I'm not too sure, I feel like I'm like reading story time to like a bunch of kids right now. Uh, I'm looking at this upside down, and two things just came out. It's like that registration card thing that comes in every game you get. And then, there's this card. And the back is just warranty information, so, you know, that's stuff that no one wants to read, and I hope you really don't read. Um, okay, yeah, so these are, like, original, like, sketches and stuff and designs for Sora. Um, oh yeah, that is definitely the original concepts for Sora. And it's on, like, tracing paper, so you can see the difference between, uh, you know... Sora that we know, and then, like, their first draft of him, which is, like, totally different. He was, like, furry, which I'm glad they didn't do. Just saying. Winnie the Pooh art, Peter Pan art. I said Peter. Peter Pan. That should be, like, their mascot. Peter's mascot is Peter Pan. More Keyblade designs and sketches and tracing paper stuff. This is really cool actually. And I'm looking at this upside down. Artwork. It's all just like sketches and stuff which is really cool to look at. And then the disc is in the back of the book. Which is really cool. It's on the back. Like the back cover. The little the last page. And then if you want to come out at least you know it's in there pretty tight. Don't remember Sora with a crown, but that's okay. So, that's what you get in the standard edition. Oh wow, there we go. That's what you get in the standard edition for Kingdom Hearts 1.5 HD Remix. Um, let me see here. You get Kingdom Hearts uh, Final Mix. Uh, you get Kingdom Hearts... RE Chain of Memories, which was on Game Boy Advance, and then they remade it for PS2. Um, so that's included on here as well. And then you get Kingdom Hearts 358 over two days. Um, HD remastered. Um, that one was on the DS. And then Dream Drop Distance came out on 3DS. 
this is the DS one, 358 over 2. So you get three games in one with this. Um, so it should definitely keep you occupied for quite some time. And uh, that, that's pretty much it. There's not much else to go over. It's standard edition. There is a special edition, and I think that's like a full hardcover book with... You get like a digital ebook thing or something, I don't know. I haven't really read up on that all too much. But, uh, so this is what you get. Uh, if you haven't played it yet, and you're thinking about it, now would be the best time to do it. It's, I think, 40, it was 40 bucks for standard. Which makes sense, considering it's an old PS2 game. Um, so, that's, that's pretty much it. Uh, if you're a, a big fan or looking to get into it for the first time, definitely check it out, pick it up. It's not even the price of a full, brand new game. Um, and yeah, that's it. So, uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys whenever I make another video. Uh, <laughs> see you guys next time.